Hi, I'm Susie. A couple days ago, I applied dual forms, or known as puppets, on Liz's nails. Let's check out, see what happened. So Liz texted me a couple of days after we applied these, and she broke two. Mm -hmm. 24 hours after that, she broke another two. So whenever a client breaks a nails, now I've been doing it, Liz's nails for about 18 years, so we do know what works for Liz, and we don't really have these problems, do you? I don't know that I've had this happen. No, you've blown a nail a couple here and there doing some things, but never like this. Mm -mm. So when a client breaks a nail, we really want to examine why it broke. There are several ways it can break. In this case, all four nails have broken right across the stress point. We still have one left. Not bad, this one. So if I examine these nails, and I can examine every single finger, because every single finger has a story, and every single nail has to be custom made to them. That may be what's going on here, is that these aren't really custom made, simply because of the way the system is designed. So when I look at the thumb, if we look down that thumb this way, this, as you can see where it is broken, this is the stress point, this is the arch, this is where it needs to be the thickest point. And if I look at this, I'm thinking, why did this break? Well, I can look at it and see it's extremely thin. That's how the end of a nail should be, not across the stress point. So when I look at this finger, this one's a little bit thicker, which is good, but it's not as thick as it needed, clearly, because it broke. This one, it's a little bit thicker too, but it still broke, probably because it's a little too thin here. It's not even either. Mm -mm. Pinky, it's no wonder we lost Pinky. <laughs> Poor little <Whittle> Pinky. <laughs> it's extremely thin across that stress point. So whenever a client comes in and she has a broken nail, we want to examine why it broke. In this case, my opinion is they broke because they're all too thin across the structure. So what's different when I did these, these are acrylic and I custom built them with a form and sculpting with a form and I'm able to build the stress point in where I'm so used to doing over the years. But this is what we did different. We did the dual forms, what's known also as poppets. And that is where you paint a gel or acrylic inside and then you pop it on. You can check out that video if you didn't look at it already. We don't want to blame the system. This is not the system's fault. This is not the product line that I use's fault at all. Its limitations are, it's meant to be the simplest way we can possibly think of. It's a brilliant idea to make a nail as easy as we possibly can. But unfortunately, tips are not custom made to this client. In my opinion, it'll work for some people, but not for every client. And that's why custom nails are so important to sculpt, or you can even put a tip on, but then you're sculpting the rest over top to build it for your particular client. Makes sense to me. And it was gel. Gel isn't quite as strong as acrylic, but gel can be amazing if it's structurally sound. <laughs> are we going to fix these? We're going to fix these. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to put what we usually put on here, and we're going to custom design them. It was a great experiment, and I really do think it's a cool idea. Mm -hmm. I think it's a really great idea, but it may not fit for everybody. I still don't think we've seen the end of these. I think we're going to perfect it and perfect mm -hmm. it. So there's still some great potential here. All in all, it was fun to try. I love trying new products. It was, actually. Mm -hmm. it was mm -hmm. Really neat to yeah. see. Yeah, it's a really great concept. And it just didn't work for this particular client. And we're going and to And that's move. okay. Yeah, and that's okay. Yeah, we had fun doing it. Well, thanks for joining me. No problem. Thank you for joining me. And I hope you understand it. If not, leave the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them in fuller detail. We're still going to see some more of these and we're going to, we're going to play with it some more. Thanks for joining me. See you soon.